Welcome to 8 News at 530. An arrest has been made following two deadly shootings that happened last week on the same day on the same road. I'm Deanna Albritton. I'm Eric Phillips. 8 News reporter Alexis Bellamy spoke to a lead detective on the case and she joins us now live with details on this arrest. Alexis, good evening. Deanna, Eric, good evening. Now the Richmond police, along with the U.S. Marshals Regional Task Force, arrested 22-year-old Khalil Rogers of North Chesterfield on Wednesday in connection to the murder of DeAndre Broidy. Now, Broidy was the first of two victims that were killed in two separate shootings on Ruffin Road. Last Friday, officers were called to the 2200 block of Ruffin Road after they received calls about a shooting. When officers arrived on the scene, they couldn't find the victim. He was found a short distance away near the 5600 block of Warwick Road in his car. Police believe he was trying to go to the hospital after being shot. Broidy was then transported to the hospital where he later died. Rogers was later arrested near Midlothian Turnpike and charged. Here is Mark Godwin with Richmond Police Department Major Crimes Division. He was arrested for conspiracy to commit murder and we will be speaking with the Commonwealth attorney for additional charges. Police aren't sure yet, but they say based on this point in the investigation, they don't believe Rogers acted alone. As far as Rogers, we're still trying to identify other individuals that may have been present at the time. And so we're trying to identify those individuals and speak with them. 52 people in Richmond have lost their lives to gun violence in 2022. The shootings on December 9th raised that number to 54, and there are still two weeks left in the year. The only message that I will say, if you see something, say something. Uh, this is your community, and if you see something that does not look right, call 911 or call Crime Stoppers at 780-1000. There's no word yet on a suspect for the second shooting that also took place on Ruffin Road last week. And the Richmond Police Department has not confirmed whether the two shootings were connected. It is very unique. I cannot recall an incident where an incident as similar as this has taken place, but I can't elaborate to say yes or no at this time. Now, both shootings are still under investigation. Any information about either homicide is encouraged to call the Richmond police. In Richmond, Alexis Bellamy, 8 News.